Alright guys, welcome back to episode 7 of my Batman Arkham Asylum series. If you've enjoyed the videos up till now, drop a like, leave a comment, smash the subscribe button. If you haven't seen any of the episodes before this, you can check out the playlist. Um, uh, you can check it out on my channel home. Anyway, let's, uh, let's continue onwards. If you, if you guys don't remember, in the last episode we got this new tool, the Backclaw. He ain't listening anymore, Joker. Also, uh, guys, I just wanted to say my voice is a little bit weird. I've been ill part over the past few days, like properly ill, like bedridden. So I'm sorry about that if it does sound weird. My if it doesn't, then. Visiting academics in both Metropolis and Keystone, I was exposed to a wealth of new ideas. That's good. I began my day returning home in good spirits, eager to see my wife and family. I ended it kneeling in their blood, broken fragments of my life, pouring through dripping red fingers. That is harrowing. Yeah, that's just downright harrowing. <laughs> there's, there's like nothing you can say in that situation that would lighten the mood. Like, that is just... Yeah. Okay. Why are we the one to Take these guys down. I don't even know what they're doing here. They're just something. Something. Joker's goons are doing something. I am always rusty for some reason in this game. But I uh, will get the job done. Anyway, as I was saying before, my voice is a bit weird, so... If you guys can't notice the difference, then that's cool. But if you guys can, then I'm, I'm sorry about that. There's nothing I can do. And I wanted to keep up with my upload schedule, you know. I want to keep, you know, doing one video a week at least. So... I uh, had to compromise there a bit, so I'm not properly healed, my th throat is still a bit sore and I've got a runny nose, but I, uh, I, I do what I can, you know. Probably shouldn't talk to him like that. And that meeting did not end well, as we'll probably find out. I will find you. Rip your flesh like paper. Okay, admit it. Which one of you got scared by that? <laughs> I know. One of Joker's oldest aliases. So, Joker pays Dr. Young to create his army, and then all of a sudden he stops. Doesn't make any sense. Okay. I know the first time that I played this game, that literally made me jump off of my chair. That was like... I mean, that was literally... Well, you should run out of time all the time, Joker. I, I mean, Riddler. You're not the Joker. God, I really can't think straight today, can I? Puzzle has many sides, but only some are visible. Well, that's interesting. Oh, 
Oh no, I remember this sequence. First time I spent like 20 minutes. First time I played this game, I, was, I remember I spent like 20 minutes trying to get through this like maze. I just ended up like not finding anything or getting anywhere. Sounds like she had a change of heart. She tried to block the payments. Joker doesn't like it when his partners try to back out. So he decided to get himself back to Arkham, find his formula, and create the army himself. Exactly. Well, that clears stuff up, I suppose. I've hacked into an email account. Two mails stand out. The first is a resignation letter dated last week. Sounds like she was trying to get away. And the second? A message from Joker. Well, Jack White. It's a long thread. It was that donkey. Scared her. Not the dead baby or anything, it was just a donkey. God, I have the worst sense of humor in all of the world. That much is confirmed. <coughs> okay, sorry about that. It's just that I'm not fully recovered yet. Ooh, an upgrade. Let's see. Let's finish off the armor upgrades and then we can get something more interesting. If you guys want, you can leave comments on what you think I should get. That was great. Okay, just completely screwed that one up. And now we're back. Here we go. There's another Riddler trophy over there, so let's go grab that real quick. Is there anything back here? It looks like there would be something back. No, nope. invisible walls. Okay, so let's go this way then. Wait a minute, there's something here that so we can climb, so there's obviously something here. Long fall. If you fall off this. Ugh. It's gonna be a hell of a long ride. Right, we're on safe ground again. The way out. So I did it without wandering around in endless circles like I did the first time I played this game. So that's good. Right, we're through. Well, let's uh, let's hope she wisened up a bit, because I'm pretty sure that thing can eat animals. I mean, humans and animals. Does that all the time. Here we go. Blow this wall up and get through.
So, have uh, have any of you guys who are watching this played these games before? If you have, what do you think of them? If you haven't, what do you think from the watching this series? Do you think it's a good game? Let me know in the comments. You know, you feel free to let me know. You also can not do that if you want, but. Have I got the audio all up? Because that sounded a little bit quiet to me. Just got audio options. Yeah, I've got the audio up. Okay. Well, let's resume then. Right. Move. Move, 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 move. Then we can get behind him. There we go. Then we can get into the mansion. I believe that's where we're going, right? Yes, we're going to the mansion, and the mansion is nowhere near here. So, to there? To, no, to here, right? To here, then? Arkham East? Yes, okay. So this is the way we're going. Let's just go there quick before these guys notice me. Oh no. Well, let's take these guys out real quick. Counter that. Ah, the guy keeps blocking my punches. Okay, I didn't see any of that last fight because of these bushes over here, but okay. We, we dealt with them fair and proper. That's just, that's just nasty. I mean, you're really a psycho if you do that. Killing them is one thing, but that's just... Ugh. Oh, crap. I didn't think they'd have snipers here. Ugh. I'm gonna die, aren't I? I am definitely gonna die to this. Okay. Safe for now. They can't, the lasers can't get through that, so I should be safe. Oh, 
Okay. We dealt with that guy, got a bit of our life back. Let's just get rid of this guy. Interview tape in there. I won't touch that until after I've dealt with the murderous good. Okay. Murderous good is out for the count and we can finally use the interview tape. Seems like all of these interviews end with threats, which is something, if you have a weird fetish for threats. Uh, we'll deal with them very soon. Okay, this is getting on my nerves. Yeah, this is really getting on my nerves. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> oh, isn't that cute? Little bats are sleeping. Someone finish him off. I hate snipers. They're so difficult, especially in this game. Because like you have no solid way of dealing with them from a distance. You have to get up close. I mean you could batarang one, but it's it's difficult. Oh, seriously? From here? Oh uh, well. At least I can start off clean this time. Okay, so we dealt with those guys, well that guy, now to deal with this guy, and then we can move in from, what, the side? Come on, this guy, quickly. Please remember to keep an eye open for any flying rodents during your duties. We've already uh, listened to that one, so... Alright, so get to the side and then we'll figure it out from the side. So through the graveyard here, baby. Come on, quick, 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 before they shoot you, Batman. Hopefully they won't notice you coming in. Come on. What are you doing, Batman? Here we go. Should be able to grapple up there. Nice. Before I do take those out, I'm pretty sure there's some Riddler trophies around here. And they're... They're, they're pretty innovative trophies up here, I think. I remember finding a couple of them myself, so... Should be pretty easy to find some of these things. Here we go. This is one. This is one that I've liked a bit. Quite a bit. Here we go. Grapple onto here. And I believe there is a spot somewhere here. Yeah. There we go. So now we have to line up the Riddler trophy. And then there's one actual trophy over here, I believe. At the very end, I think. It's somewhere around here. You know what, I'm not going to waste my time with that. 
you guys can check it out. I'm sure there's a trophy around here somewhere because I remember, remember collecting it in the last time I played this game. There's also one right here, which I don't remember collecting, but there you go. Seriously, we can't go down here? Oh, I was wondering why Batman keep running into walls. Don't notice. Don't you dare turn around. I'll actually kill you. There we go. Wow, that was one of the sneakiest entrances I've ever made in a video game, ever. I suck at stealth. Is what I'm trying to say. Right. <coughs> God, my throat hurts so much. Okay, we're in here. It's a pretty creepy place. This should be a piece of cake. They're knocked out. Not anymore, though. Shouldn't be too difficult, though. There we go. And he's out. A well-seasoned punch to the head. Good one. Right, let's keep going. I believe we're going to have to go up there. Yep, it's a locked door. So up here. There we go. Oh, hit it, Batman. There you go. This is actually a lot easier than it looks. I mean, honestly, I'm just making a right mess of it, is what I'm doing. It's actually a lot easier to do. To handle the controls and all. There we go. I returned to my work, but I could not shake the pictures from my mind. I should have been repulsed, but I was more eager than ever to find an explanation for why someone would do this. That was a short one. Okay. Well. Who is the main man in the main hall? Okay, that's I don't think I can fight all those goons, but there's no other way really, so yeah, let's, let's fight all those goons. Yep, I'm gonna die. There is no way I cannot. Ah, this sucks. I suck at combat so bad. I need to really get on the horse. Oh yeah, you hit like an old lady. Well, old ladies can hit really hard if they want to. I have experience, don't ask. Okay, now we're getting no. I mean, now we're getting going. God, my brain really doesn't work today. And yeah, he's out. Who's the main man in the main hall? I answered this Riddle Trophy quest before and I'll do it again. 
Really? Because it hasn't been getting harder recently. You really haven't been upping your game. I mean, for example, if this is what you call harder, then I'd love to see what you call easier. Oh, no. Spent too much time trash talking. Just climb this real quick. There we go. That was like the easiest one. It's right in front of you. Okay, so where do we go now? To the right, then. This way, I think. Because that's the only way we can go. And I'm correct. What does a bird need in the rain? Is that an umbrella? An, an umbrella? Come on. Don't torture me like this. Ugh. Why is it obscure? That's Penguin's umbrella. You know it. I know it. You are performing just below my predicted expectation. At this rate, you'll never beat me. Oh yeah, sure. That's real nice of you, man. They brought the animal before me, shameless and barking like a mad dog. For what felt like days, I endured his boasts. He took pleasure recounting his actions, cataloging his depraved crimes. What should have been revenge turned to pity. This poor dog needed my help. Okay. And there's another vent over there. Break that open. Before we fight those guys, I'm just gonna go in here. Because there's a Riddler trophy. And he's out. Great. Mm, and on we go. In the library. I've got to take out these knife guys as quickly as I can. They are honestly annoying. I hate these guys so much. You can't hit them. And they constantly attack you. Like... Finally. Finally, they're out. Yeah, 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 sure. Help, help the helpless hostages. Because, sure, that's not a trap, is it? No, no, it's definitely not a trap. There we go. Uh, Batarang. Dual Batarang. Critical. I'm gonna get this one because this one doubles the power of the normal combat strikes, which is really useful. Because then it allows me to finish fights quicker and I don't lose as much health. Well, 
Oh, I thought I was trapped in here. Two minutes, two minutes in counting. Okay, I'm sure we can manage that in two minutes. It's not that difficult. This really is a winding network, isn't it? There we go. Ugh. There we go. Okay, let's dis defuse this bomb. Don't know about you, Batman, but that's not how you defuse a bomb. Thank you, Batman. Are they all gone? Yes, you safe. What happened? It, it all happened so fast. Some patients broke in, began tearing up the place. But they were looking for something. Bill here fought back, but there were too many. They took Dr. Young. She rushed in here and they followed. I'm sorry. When I came to, we were all tied up. Doc Young was gone. Well, that's alright. You guys want much of a match for them anyway. So now we have to leave here. And I presume we're going to Doc Young's office or something. <laughs> I mean, I'm spoiling here because that's what I do. I spoil. But that's all I can remember at least so here and then out through here nope that's not the way out the way out is this way I assume okay this is the way out this fiendish puzzle literally appears out of thin air and I think I know where it appears <laughs> Okay, fan? Yes, are you a fan? Yes, uh, dot, there's a dot here somewhere. Just can't remember where exactly this dot is. Uh, I remember if you stand somewhere here, there'll be a dot somewhere on these vents. And you could look down at the thing and scan it. And it'll give you your puzzle mark. I just can't remember where the dot is exactly, but if you guys needed to know, that's where it was. So continue to search the other rooms of the mansion. Right, so we go back the way we came. They're up already. Oh no, that's two new goons, I think. And he's out. Okay, we can move on. Now, where do we go? All right, so we have to open this one up. All ID cards are to be shown. Well, not Batman's. Right, what is he wearing? What is that? I do not remember. What's that collar do? Why is it making that noise? It's the suicide collar. It sounds weird. Suicide collar? Well, they've got some other name, but, well, we just use them to monitor patients' heart rates. If it drops too low, the alarm goes off and a crash team rushes in. And so does my crew if it's really well. <laughs> Okay. Well, shut up, you sound weird, man. It sounds like a dog barking. 
which is well weird for a suicide collar. Okay. Okay. Gee, shut up. All right. I am. Uh, well, I'm gonna. Yeah. Okay. I think I'm gonna end this episode here. We've been playing for a while, and we did a lot of stuff today. We uh, we entered the mansion, we left the bat cave, and we found out what the suicide collar was. So if you guys enjoyed the episode, uh, you know, drop a like, leave a comment, smash the subscribe button. It really does help me out, and I'll see you guys in the next one.